By the time a skier gets to the slopes, he's already committed his vacation time and he's come a long way to get there. There may be little or no competition up there, and the rental shops can charge whatever they want. Mr. Singh could rent out equipment here in town for a far lower price. By renting skis for $30, for example, he can attract a lot of customers used to paying higher. Hey, he'd only have to rent out the skis seven times to make the money he'd make from selling them. Of course, Mr. Singh would need a system for keeping track of the equipment, pay to maintain it, and they'd need to set aside part of his store just for rentals. But he'd probably get more customers. And all those rental customers might buy other stuff while they're in the store, like hats and mittens. He could do the same with surfing, golf, and scuba gear in the summer. I'll tell Mr. Singh he'd better get over to the stationery store. Why the stationery store? So he can return those going out of business signs. <laughs>